Today we'll be having a look at the eTrailer.com round snap ring swivel jack with foot plate. Part number TJBB-2001-B. With the eTrailer.com jack installed, we'll no longer need to worry about using a jack stand or other device to hold our trailer coupler off the ground now. Our landing gear makes contact with the ground, which will keep our coupler off the ground. One thing that I like about it is how easy it is to use. With our folding arm here, we can easily crank to raise our jack, which will then raise our coupler higher off the ground or off our trailer ball. We have quite a bit of range of motion here, which makes it easy to couple and uncouple to multiple different vehicles, which may or may not have a different hitch height on them. One thing that's great is that it is a folding design. So when we're coupled up to our vehicle to help reduce the interference from the ground or potentially running our jack into something, we can pull this lever and we can swing the jack back and up to a horizontal position where we'll have the most ground clearance possible. Now you can swing it back or you can swing it forward if you need to as well depending upon if you have anything mounted on the frame of your trailer, which could interfere with the jack. To help increase the life of our jack, it is greasable via this Zerk fitting right here. The jack gives us 10 and a half inches of travel. So from the foot peg all the way up to the bottom, we'll have 10 and a half inches of range of motion in order for us to couple and uncouple from our vehicle easily. Now this jack has a 2,000 pound lift capacity, so it has the ability to lift a trailer with a 2,000 pound tongue weight. It has a 3,000 pound support capacity, so if we weren't lifting and we just wanted to hold a trailer in place, we could easily do that with a 3,000 pound tongue weight. Now this jack is designed to work with its multiple attachment points on trailer frames anywhere from two inches tall to no more than four inches tall. It'll also work on trailer frames that are no more than three inches wide. The diameter of our outer tube is two and a quarter inches wide, and our inner tube is two inches wide. The outer tube and the brackets have a black powder coat finish, so it's strong and durable. Our hardware, our handle, and our landing gear have a zinc finish on them, so they'll also be very rust and corrosion resistant. From the center of our handle, to the outer part, we have a radius of seven and three quarters of an inch. So just keep that in mind, so where you mount it, you'll be able to have full rotation. Our foot plate dimensions are seven and a half inches long by three and three quarters inches wide. Now because of the large surface area of our foot plate, if we park our trailer in an area of soft ground, this will help minimize sinking into the ground. Now many of our customers have stated that they found this jack to be very strong and durable, even a year later after purchasing it. They also like how it comes with all the mounting hardware you need to install it. There's no guesswork on what you're going to need in order to get it in place on your trailer. A couple have mentioned that they really like the fact that you can easily grease it so you don't have to worry about it drying out and becoming difficult to use. Now when we compare this to the Pro Series round jack, part number PS1400300303, the Pro Series jack doesn't have a Zerk fitting on it, so it's not as easily greasable as the eTrailer.com jack. Here we are at our trailer. As you can see, we don't have a jack on it right now, and we're left to support it with alternate methods. In our case, since we're in our install bay, we're using our lift, You'd also have to use a jack stand or cinder blocks or blocks of wood or something like that in order to keep your tongue off the ground when you're unhooked from your vehicle. So this is where having a jack would be really handy. We'd be able to have our trailer easier to hook up no matter where we are. We don't want to bring cinder blocks or jack stands or blocks of wood with us anymore. And to begin our install, you'll notice how we have multiple different holes along the side of our jack. This is to accommodate different heights of frames. So we're gonna hold it up and see which holes line up best for our case. For us, we'll be using the second hole here and the bottom hole. So we'll go ahead and put bolts through these locations on both sides. Now these brackets are a little bit different. The way they line up, 
we'll be using the top hole here on the top and then we'll skip one and then go down to this one on the bottom and we'll thread on our nylon lock nut. Now we'll snug down our hardware using a 9 16 wrench and socket, ensuring that our bolts are flat against the trailer frame on the top. With our bolts tightened down, we now have a nice secure jack to our trailer. And that'll complete our look at the eTrailer.com round snap ring swivel jack with foot plate. Part number TJBB-2001-B.